KDA gang, KDA fam. We're looking at KDA on the four hour time frame right now. If you guys gain any value out of this video at all, be sure to leave a like, comment, sub, all that fun stuff. Even give it a share to fellow KDA holders. And check out the links to my Discord and such in the description down below on those little clicky buttons. It makes it all easy. Anyway, looking at KDA. So what we had highlighted last time is pretty much this box right here. I do just want to put an emphasis on this. So this zone that we had marked is a big zone. As you can see, big reaction, big reaction, big reaction. Pretty much this was the point where we capitulated from over here. Uh, if we were to go back even further, which we could, you can see for the most part, this general vicinity is a big, big area. So, uh, that's the farthest on this chart. So regardless, you kind of see the emphasis of the importance on that. Now, if you were to end up coming back on down here, which that's not what the case of this video more or less is, but if you do, I'm just going to get this out of the way now. Either look for a higher low to necessarily come in here, or you're going to come down to this lower zone, and then you're going to blast off from there. Um, and then, for the most part, you'd end up holding that low. If you don't end up holding that low, and you make a slightly lower low, um, you, you're not going to be breaking past 78 cents, I could tell you that much. Uh, otherwise, I should mention this. Zone, if we were to break that, is going to be between about 105 to 112. That being said, overall upside target, once again, looking to just get back to that $2 range. From there, more likely than not, you will end up breaking through, just like, phew. Um, and then, yeah, you're going to be looking for at least $2.42. And then, really, from there, the next major high is going to be about $3.40. And we could extrapolate the zone from the higher time frame. And that is really more or less just getting you back up to here. Yeah. After 246, it's kind of just straight up. Uh, there's not a lot of volume. You can even see that on the right side of the screen. You don't even get a pickup in volume until about like $5.62. So just keep that in mind. Um, and yeah, so there's really not too much else for me to necessarily go over as we just kind of been chopping around here. So other than that, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Also would like to know what you guys overall bull run targets are. Do you think it's actually going to reclaim its all time high, which was at about $28, if I'm not mistaken, all the way up here? Yeah, about $28. Do you think it's going to reclaim that or is it just going to go into like a larger retracement? Not break this high. Is it just going to that and then go down or is it just going to do that and then continue going? I don't know. Let me know in the comment section down below whether or not you agree with me, disagree with me, with me and your targets. Other than that, you guys have a phenomenal day as always. None of this is financial advice. And yeah, adios muchachos.